All right, so we're going to cover how to add music to your radio station. All right, I want to start screen. You want to go down to media. Click on media. It's going to take you to this screen here. All right, this is the main screen you'll use to uh, basically manipulate your radio station as far as the music on there. All right, on the left hand side, these are all your playlists here. The ones with stripes through them are the ones that are there but are deactivated. You can still add music to them, but they're just not, they're not activated, so they're not going to actually play. All right, the ones that are, but don't, don't have the line through them are all the actual ones that are active. All right, you have the light rotation, standard rotation, heavy rotation. Um, you can create more playlists. Uh, we have a video on that. You can watch that to see how to create more playlists. Uh, these are standard folders that are created uh, when you first launch your station. So the difference between these default folders of this, um, you have the heavy rotation, which plays means the song will play or the content will play more than um, anything else in the station. You have the light rotation, I mean it plays less than anything else in the station. Then you have standard rotation. Standard rotation just it'll play on average. Okay, so if you like something a lot, you put it here in the heavy rotation. If you don't like it a lot, you don't want it to play as often, I should say put in light rotation everything else for the most but you'll probably put here all right this is the foundation for your for your um, radio station rotation let me show you how to add stuff to it there's three different ways to add content to your stations playlist first is if you um, upload something in your radio station for the most part if the mp3 was created correctly um, it'll actually show you the name of all the artists that you have in your station all right if you click the name, let's say they have multiple albums, it will show you on this side all the albums of the artist. So if you have a person that may, you may put like 10 songs in there and they're all from 10 different albums. When you click that person's name, it will show you all 10 albums they created. Once you click this one, it will actually show you in this album what songs you actually have on your station from that album. All right, all these songs are basically here by way of what you uploaded, as you saw in the previous videos or the video you'll watch next. Okay, so three ways, like I said, to add music. You can take everything this artist does and put into one of your folders, whether it be standard, light, or heavy. I'm gonna go and put it in standard for right now. You're gonna notice that when I do that, before I do it, you see how it says uh, zero, 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 zero. When I put it in there, you watch, you're gonna see that time's gonna change. One more time. All right, there you go. So I did 17 minutes to my rotation. All right. Now let's say I want to add the whole album. You can go here and you can drag the whole album, whatever album you like. I'm gonna put this in the light rotation. 17 minutes again because it's pulling all four of these songs. Or if it's a particular song that I want, maybe I don't want everything in that album. Maybe it's just a certain song I like. I just go to that song, select it, and add it. All right. So there's three options. If you want everything that person has in your in your station, you select the name, folder, and drag it to whatever playlist you want it to be in. If there's a certain album you just like that person did, maybe it was a good year that year. You drag that album over into the playlist or if it's a certain song in the album select the album and then I'll show you all the songs in that album and then select that song and put it over in your playlist all right all the playlists work exactly the same regardless of how you have it set up as far as adding content to it um, for those of you who may have created additional playlists it all works the same it all works the same you just basically select your um, what you want and drag it over into that particular folder once it's here, as soon as it's here, it automatically goes into rotation. And when your server um, radio station is playing, it automatically updates. There's nothing more you got to do here to actually, um, you know, make it go. Let me show you this too. Let's say if it's something you put in your playlist and you really didn't want to be there, or you said, you know, I, I maybe want to move it. You maybe want to move it to a different section. You click on the playlist. It's going to open up the actual folder. And you can go in here and say, if I want to take that one out of it. 
uh, highlight the one I want to take out. You have multiple ones. Just hold the control button down and select them. And then go down here and click remove. Once you click remove, you want to go ahead and save it. All right, you click save. It updates your playlist. And now that song is removed. Let's say if you removed it by accident. Before you click save, you can click revert. And it should go ahead and put it back in there if you accidentally deleted one by accident. All the folders have the same exact options. Select the ones you don't want. Let's take take a few of them out here. Click remove. And we're going to click save this time. Once we click save, we go back into that folder. You're going to see that, that those two songs are gone. Okay. So that's how you would basically add music to your radio station and also how you can actually uh, change files that are in your different folders um, for your playlist, different playlists. You can change the files. All right.